You may have noticed signs or billboards popping up in Metro this week that maybe you're getting a few stares. It's a new advertising campaign and some call it hate. Others say it's just free speech. Fox 5's Beth Parker has the story. It's very controversial, yeah. I don't think it's very appropriate. They may not like it, but Metro riders will now be seeing these. A sign with a quote from Osama bin Laden. The first thing that we are calling you is to Islam. That's crazy. <laughs> I don't see why that we would have that in our station. Seeing his face especially, you know, the country that, I mean, that's not a face you want to see too often, especially what he did to this country. Pamela Geller is the woman behind the signs. She co-founded an organization called Stop Islamization of America. People need to know that Pamela Geller, the sponsor of these ads, is one of the nation's leading anti-Muslim bigots. She's recognized as that. The Southern Poverty Law Center has named her as one of the nation's uh, uh, inner circle of hate mongers uh, regarding Islam. After a court case, Wamada was forced to display Geller's ads. It's an issue of free speech, though it comes with a disclaimer. Because you should be able to express yourself, but when something's so controversial and could offend certain people, I don't think it should be up there. Now, the ads just went up this week, and they'll be in metro stations in the city and the suburbs for a month. In Washington, Beth Parker, Fox 5 News.